Hi, this is Mike Schofield with Dynon Avionics. In this video series, we'll be showing you some of the features and capabilities of our new Dynon Skyview system. Enjoy. So we'd like to show you how the Dynon Skyview system is, is a little bit different from our current line of products. The products that we currently sell are integrated single box avionics. So this is our Flight Deck D180. Um, it is about four and a half inches deep and that could present some panel fitment issues in, um, in tight panels. All of the features and functions of the product are basically in this box. So you have your connectors for your engine uh, sensors, you have your power, you've got your air data computer, all the inertial sensors are in here as well. So you've got your attitude um, and, and uh, you know, heading determining system in this box. In contrast, Skyview is a little bit more modular. You choose either 7 or 10 inch screens and they're really, really thin. You can see how the, the nice slim profile, that'll help them get into um, the rear seats of tandem cockpits in particular. And instead of including all of the different sensors in the unit in th themselves, they are in these different modules. So the engine monitor module has the same electronics as in our current products, and you can see that there is the same connectors. So if you have a current Dynon EMS, you can upgrade to the Skyview simply by taking those harnesses and plugging them into this module. We have our ADA HARS module, and this provides attitude, magnetic heading, and all of the air data, indicated airspeed, altitude, and if you have our angle of attack pedo, you can do that as well. And then we have our 5 hertz GPS receiver module. This gets GPS into the system to provide the synthetic vision display and to provide position for the moving map. So in contrast with our current products where you select the product that that incorporates the features that you want, the, the EFIS or the engine monitor, with the Skyview you start by choosing your screens and then adding the modules that you want the system to um, to be able to take advantage of. So if you're going to fly a day VFR airplane, you might go with a single screen, an engine monitor module, and an ADA HARS, and the GPS. If you're flying IFR, you can double up the screens, double up the ADA HARS, still use a single engine monitor module, and then you have a fully redundant IFR panel where either a HARS can fail and either screen could fail and you would still have full flight instruments and full engine instruments to get yourself back on the ground. Thanks for watching this video about the new Dynon Skyview system. You can find more videos like this at www.dynonavionics.com.